Hey there all, welcome to Homemade Collectibles YouTube channel. This is a re review of the custom Jurassic Park Canner Series 2 inspired electronic Gala Minus action figure. This is a, a review of this uh, product. So this is a retro inspired item. It is from the Jurassic Park Kenner toy line. And as you can see, the box here is uh, even inspired by the old Jurassic Park Kenner toys. So this is a retro tribute to that figure. If you don't know, the Series 2 Gallimimus came in 1994. It was an electronic Gallimimus figure, and this is kind of a tribute to that. So, let you know now the figure is not electronic, and it actually tells you in the box, which we'll take a look at, Batteries not needed. This is a really cool packaging for the Jurassic Park toy line that we tried to uh, replicate in the best and with the budget we had of the original toy. So you can see it's got that Dino Screams logo, action dinos, batteries not included. It's got the three sound stripes that it had, just like the original packaging. Up there, we kind of did a little funny thing where we wrote Evil Gallimimus Murder, codename Murder, with neck action. So that does have an action feature um, similar to the original toy, but a little bit different. There's the figure itself, and it does include one capture gear piece, which is by the tail, which we'll show that later on. It does come with a authentic movie card, and that is something you can take off from the packaging, and you can see the card right there. There's also more images of that card <clears throat> in our listing below. The link of this video, the Dress Park logo, ages 12 plus. On the side, there is the Kenner logo, and here it says with capture gear, and there's the figure in the packaging. But even the way the figure is packaged like this, we tried to replicate it. It wasn't packaged like straight, it was packaged kind of curving down, so we kind of replicated that. And the back of the box, um, it's regular, we didn't replicate it, we didn't need to, just our company logo, um, don't put this there in liquid, it's just an online exclusive, figure number six in our movie monster toy line. So what's really cool about this is you can actually take the figure out of the packaging without having to damage it. So if you want to display it with the packaging, the toy, or take it off, you can put it back in so it's collector friendly. So here is the, actually I'll take the packaging off. And so you can remove the card. We'll see more images of that, but we'll want to take a look at the figure. I don't want to make this video too, too long. So the figure is a really cool Gallimimus. We tried to replicate the actual Series 2 Kenner Gallimimus, especially with that head sculpt. It had a really, really interesting head sculpt. And you can see right there, it's really awesome looking, a lot of detail. And the coloring was also really fun to work on. You can see it's got those stripes, those red stripes, just like the original toy, the arms. And then it's got the um, yellowish tan under color all the way through the figure. The feet also was pretty cool. It's got that long, not long, but like extended, um, kind of uh, bloated toes that the original toy had, so we try to replicate that. And it's also got the JP logo, JP24. That was the original number for the original toy. You can see the other side, really great detail and coloration. Top there as well. And then there's the bottom, the tail, and we'll take the capture gear off in a bit. Actually, I'll take it off right now so you can see the tail better. So not only was this figure built, but it was also had to be sculpted. There were some sculpted pieces with the top of the head and then the back here. So it looked more organic and um, more accurate to the toy as best as we can. The capture gear piece is really simple. It's a gray color with little chains um, sculpted in. 
sorry. Not too crazy, but you know, the original toy did include capture gear, so which you can place on the tail as you've seen. Now the figures, articulation is basic, but it is there. You can move the arms side to side. And the arms are um, glued in place, molded in place, so they're not like soft arms, you know, they're um, glued in here, glued pieces here, so they're secured in nicely. And then this leg is articulated a little bit. And then this leg is not because it has the action feature, which I'll show um, right now. So the action feature is really basic. You pull the tail back and forth and this uh, right leg and the neck will move in motion. So it's really easy, really basic. Show on the other side. So it's kind of simulating that it's running like it did in the original film and also in the original toy. And um, yeah, it's it works pretty well. And yeah, and it goes in back in the body real nicely. So it's not like you're gonna have a gigantic gap in the dinosaur toy. So yeah. Um, this figure is available for an affordable price if you're interested to purchase one for yourself. If you want to see more details of this item, if you just want to see more pics of it. And we also did some comparison pics with some of the, uh, or actually one of the Kenner uh, official items that they released in 1993. So check those out. That's going to be in the link below. Oops. So yeah, really cool looking custom Gallimimus figure. If you always wanted it, uh, the original Series 2 one, but it was too expensive, you know, mint in box. This is an option out there. Um, I know it's kind of weird that this is a, it's not a plastic toy, it is a origami figure, but it's not like soft paper, it's a really nice paper materials and there's also metal pieces for the posability and also the figure has been um, tested so we want to you know we want to be proud of what we make you know and also this is a um you know make it cool and just something interesting out there so check out the link below for more details and if you want to purchase one for yourself it is really affordable if you're interested in our auto um, items as well, there's going to be links for them below. Um, comment down below what you think of this item. If you want to see more, um, share this with your friends. Give us a like, subscribe, and um, thank you for watching. Let us know what kind of content you want to see, and have a good one.